my next guest say solar power is really the way to go. Michael Stritsky is the owner of the first energy independent home in North America that has passed strict regulatory standards and runs purely on solar and hydrogen power. In today's Going Green segment, Michael joins us now from his home in Hopewell, New Jersey, along with the CEO of the company behind the project, Peter Winslow of Renewable Energy International. Gentlemen, nice to have you with us. Welcome to the closing bell. Thanks, Maria. Thank you, Maria. Mike, let me ask you about your home. Give me a sense of, of what it's like. Do you have any, uh, you know, differences that you can share with us uh, to a traditional home? What, what, what kind of changes do you live with every day? Uh, basically, the changes are uh, almost nothing other than I don't get a power bill. Uh, I don't have a fuel delivery. And, uh, you know, all my energy is generated from the sun. I store enough energy during the summer months to power the house for the entire winter. Well, and that includes cooking gas, heating gas, and fuel for my vehicle. Well, that's really interesting. But, Peter, I mean, isn't this sort of, you know, fundamentally flawed in that, look, if the sun doesn't come out, you don't have the energy? That's exactly what the system is designed to uh, overcome, is that limitation of uh, straight solar energy. Uh, because we're storing that energy in the form of hydrogen, we're able to use it the way you'd use a battery, but a battery that never runs out. Uh, year round. So, how do you store? Yeah. How do you store the solar energy? Tell me that. You know, if you if you've got the sun and, and you don't need that energy at one point, tell me how you're storing that solar energy. During the summer months, the system makes 100 160 percent of the energy needed for the home. The 60 percent of the additional energy uh, uses a device called an electrolyzer that takes that excess electricity and turns water into its base elements, hydrogen and oxygen. We blow the oxygen off into the atmosphere, and the electrolyzer puts the hydrogen into uh, 10 1,000 gallon propane tanks at 200 pounds per square inch, the exact same pressure that's used in a propane tank. Really? During the winter months, yes, during the winter months, the uh, system only, uh, the solar system only provides 60% of my energy. So uh, when we have the uh, cold winter nights, I siphon off the hydrogen that I store during the summer, run it through a hydrogen fuel cell, and produce heat, electricity, and 100% chemically pure drinking water with absolutely no emissions and no carbon footprint whatsoever. That's it amazing. It starts as water, it ends as water. How is it possible that you don't have any utility bills? Uh, the, the solar system is designed to meet all of the energy needs. So if you size the system appropriately and you're able to do the storage adequately, um, and I use the most up-to-date energy efficient appliances I have a state-of-the-art geothermal heating and air conditioning in the house. Right. Uh, solid state lighting. So it's a combination of conservation as well as, uh, you know, using the energy, uh, you know, wisely. You know, I still have all the amenities. I have the hot tub, the big screen TV, the swimming pool. Right. And, you know, I can limit a, a normal traditional life, uh, you know, without having to, to scrimp or minimize. Peter, what, uh, what normally my elect mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Go ahead, sir. Yeah, nor yeah, normally my power bills uh, would run about $400, but the, uh, the system saves on, my, uh, on all my utility bills, everything from heat and air conditioning to the electricity to fuel for the vehicle because of the offset and the use of the uh, renewable energy right. during different times of the day and seasons of the year. Peter, how much does this cost to, to put together from your standpoint, and, and what kind of a reception are you getting? You think this is going to catch on with more people? We do think it's going to catch on. The response that we've received from people has been uh, phenomenal. A lot of people want this system today. We can't really give it to them today. The system that, that uh, is here at Mike's house is a demonstration project, an ongoing uh, research and development project, if you will, uh, that uh, cost about uh, half a million dollars uh, with everything included in it. Uh, this was uh, achieved uh, with the help of uh, industry partners and a grant from the uh, New Jersey Board of Public Utilities. Right. Uh, we think that in, with enough financing that uh, we can do the development work that's necessary and within okay. about two years have a uh, commercially viable uh, product system mm -hmm. that we'll be able to introduce in the marketplace. Really interesting, gentlemen. Thanks so much. We appreciate it.